Luminar, which is one of my favorite image enhancement and editing apps, has been upgraded to a new version that's now called Luminar AI, AI standing for Artificial Intelligence. These AI tools allow the app to analyze the image and then suggest the best preset adjustments to be applied to it, as well as control how certain tools will affect the image. In this quick lesson, we're just going to do an overview of Luminar with a couple examples. I use Luminar mostly as an extension out of the Mac Photos app. This allows me to quickly jump into the Luminar interface, make the enhancements that I want, and then quickly return that image right back into Photos. Of course, it'll also work as a standalone app, and it can also be used as a plugin for apps like Lightroom and Photoshop. So let's start with this image, which is sort of a portrait and landscape combination. I need to jump into edit mode here in Photos first, and then select Luminar AI from my extensions. That opens the image in the Luminar AI interface, and the first thing this does is suggest presets that will work best with this image. We get landscapes, scenery, and experimental. In the Experimental collection, I'm going to click on the Burned Film preset. After a few seconds, all the adjustments and effects within that preset are applied to the image. Use the buttons up here to compare before and after looks. We can dial back the effect as a whole down here with this slider. We can also add this preset to our favorites, which can then be accessed in the My Collection view. Switch to Edit Mode here to see exactly what tools Luminar has used to make these adjustments. Each tool that was used will have a gray dot next to it. Click on one to access the controls and apply those adjustments manually. Scroll down and we can see that a lot of adjustments were made with the face and skin AI tools. The amount of controls that we have just for the eyes is pretty amazing. We can quickly change the eye color as well. Or boost the eye whitening slider for a little more contrast. Here in the mouth section, we can adjust the look of her lips and the level of teeth whitening. This is a pretty impressive amount of retouching that's been done pretty much automatically in just a matter of seconds. Click Save Changes in the upper right to return the image to the Photos app. Now let's bring in this landscape to Luminar AI. We're recommended the Easy Landscapes, Filmatic, and Scenery collections. There are also several other landscape collections suggested below. This sunset preset applies well to this image, although I think it needs to be dialed back a little bit. From edit mode, we can further tweak the enhancements or even apply a completely different sky. It's also possible to insert some sun rays to enhance the look of the sunset. So that's just a quick overview of what Luminar AI can do with a couple images. Using Luminar can be a great way to quickly apply enhancements to a wide variety of images. Or the collection presets can be good starting points for your own creativity. It's one of my go-to apps anytime I'm editing photos. Luminar AI is $79 for a single license or $99 for a pair. It's available for both Mac and Windows. There's no free trial at this time, but they do provide a no questions asked 30-day money-back guarantee.
For more on how to use the Mac Photos app, check out our pair of tutorials on that subject. Thanks for watching.